Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to visit New York, New York and Las Vegas. This was during the COVID time. So the prices were a lot cheaper. That's why we went to Vegas a lot during 2020. And I have a lot of footage. So I'm really excited to share you guys our experience. We basically went and got the regular standard room with two queens. And we got a little mini view. We did get free tickets to ride their roller coaster because when we tried to use our key card to go up to the elevator, they weren't working when we're going up and down. So their way of apologizing to us was just giving us tickets to ride the roller coaster. So we were pretty excited and we we're like, all right, so that that's okay. <laughs> Cause I was kind of upset. <laughs> this is how our view looked during sunset time. And so it was just in time for us to ride the roller coaster. chicken one but we're really excited to try it i don't know why but he wanted to do the scorpio shot that is so scary looking <laughs> don't eat it <laughs> it's buzz life on steroids What do you think about the nachos? Thumbs up, thumbs down? Thumbs up? Okay, what about the ceviche? Medium, okay, what about with the lemon? Is it, go it gets better with the lemon, right? What about you, Albert, your burrito? Oh, you like it, what about the shot? <laughs> For me, the nachos are like this. The ceviche was like this, but with lemon, it was like this. So ask for lemon. Ask for a side of lemons. I asked for a side of lemons. Oh, they're gone. But it was really good with the side of lemon. I think it's. I think um, they would do a better job if it already comes with two little lemons, so that people can either choose to add lemons or not, or at least just one lemon. Because everybody eats ceviche differently. Some people like a lot of lemon, and some people want no lemon. Huh? I also asked for the sauces on the side because we thought they were going to be spicy. They're not spicy. And they also didn't taste good. I, I did not approve and my son did not approve. Oh. 
Those are not scorpions. Yeah, but is this like they're like... Why are they here? The scorpions are right there. Where? Under the leaf. Under the leaf? I don't see it. Oh, it looks like a plant to me. <laughs> I don't think there's anything in here. Bunch of insects and stuff. All right, what were you gonna tell me? Um, that this apple thing, it sounds like an apple. Okay, do it. Oh my gosh, that is a trip. I don't know if that's even like healthy for people to be biting on that plastic thing. These designs, I remember seeing them at Art Center College Design. Who years ago, I can't even remember. I gotta think to myself, when was it? I think it was probably in 2012 when I saw these installations, but they were drawn, they were made into like these little cardboard boxes. And I remember seeing them, I was like, oh, that's pretty neat. And here we go, we see them alive. 10 years later, we have Hello Kitty here. I don't know when they're gonna open up, but I know that we have one close to LA. I guess now there's one in front of New York, New York. And this is really cute. This is actually, it's complete. Cause I remember when I came back, when I came here during EDC, it was about like two years ago. All of this was being remodeled and people couldn't walk through. And there's another bar over here, completely open. Well, actually closed. I see a lot of logos of the Vikings here. I'm gonna walk towards this lady's body because it just looks fascinating because it's all lit up. I wanna touch this, excuse me. Ah! All right, so we're getting closer. So this is another bar area that's not open. I don't know if they've opened this up, but it's a sushi area and then they have California Kitchen. This is like amazing. The jalapenos, huh? That's good. I found this spot. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Oh my gosh. Can I zoom in? I can. Wow. So this is where the players practice. I don't know if that's a player over there. All the coaches. Wow. This is where we're at right now. This is where the entrance is going to be for the Raiders. I'm trying to figure out how to get all the way around just so that we can get a shot. A nice view shot of this. Calm before the storm. Pretty. All right, so this is where we actually got roomed in, which was great because a lot of people don't get roomed in this section and it was super empty and fast. 
the downside about that is that you're super far away from all the things. I think this is one of the best things about New York is that they literally have everything here. They have the Hershey store. We just by that we just passed by an Irish bar which is closed right now. It's not open because of the pandemic, so we're gonna go inside now. This gives me Disneyland vibes. itself. These are like s'mores on steroids. Oh my gosh, I freaking love s'mores. Oh my gosh, I never even knew this existed. Oh my gosh, it feels good here. I want to touch it. I know we shouldn't, but... Oh. I know I shouldn't, but it feels so good. <laughs> this is scary. <laughs> so that person says F Trump. And then you turn around and you see this girl saying Trump 2020. This is what you see. This is what you see. This is more exciting, actually. <laughs> Do you like this better than the strip? You don't know. <laughs> so would I recommend New York, New York to anyone? Absolutely. The only thing that sucks about those rooms is that they're not newly remodeled. Hopefully, maybe I don't know now and they've done some rooms that are 
remodeled, but I just like the spot of the location and the fact that they're surrounded by so many things that kids could do there. As for Fremont, I don't feel like it's kid friendly. My son kept saying he didn't like that there was a lot of like naked girls and naked booties and and all that stuff. It made him feel really uncomfortable. That's why he was like, I don't know when I asked him if he liked Fremont, but it's still a good experience. We had really fun. Hopefully this encourages you to go to Vegas and try out different hotels and I'll talk to everybody later. Bye. Let's